The Baltic countries are preparing for Russia's attack, the borders are being strengthened The Times has published an article claiming that if Russian forces move on the Baltic states they will have to cross borderland packed with mines, razor wire, and dragon's teeth. It is noted that in the early 1990s, a Latvian army officer was asked how long his force might be able to hold out against a Russian invasion. About 12 minutes, he replied. As recently as 2016 a series of war games held by RAND, a strategy think tank close to the American government, concluded that Russian tanks would reach the outskirts of Riga and Tallinn, the Latvian and Estonian capitals, within 60 hours, the situation is radically different today. NATO promises to defend every inch of territory in the three Baltic states and the alliance is assembling three brigade-level forces to protect them, with lines of reinforcement from Germany, Poland, and Finland. Now Estonia, Latvia, and Lithuania are strengthening a thousand-mile stretch of their frontiers, the most militarily exposed section of NATO's eastern flank, with a Baltic defense line of fortifications, the core element will be well over 1,000 concrete bunkers on the three countries' borders with Russia, Belarus, and the militarized Russian exclave of Kaliningrad, which lies between Poland and Lithuania. All three Baltic states have recently built fences along large parts of their borders with Russia and Belarus, although they are intended to deter migrants and smugglers rather than tanks. The vast majority of their military infrastructure is further inland.